<coughs> G'day guys, today I just wanted to run you through a script I've been using to automatically upgrade Windows 10 via the Windows Update Assistant. So you can see here if I go down to my about I currently have 1903 so what this will do is download the Windows Update Assistant which if you want to run it manually you can run it from here when it loads you can download it and run it um, but I don't want to run it manually I just want to run a script have it automatically download and install so this script here which was originally done by this person uh, I've just edited it and I've been using it which works quite well just copy it, open PowerShell as administrator and what we'll see here if I open the task manager at the same time as you can see here I'm not using much anything so what I'll do I'll start running this script hit enter and then it'll start what this script does is it downloads the update assistant and the update assistant will start downloading the new version of Windows. So you can see here my Ethernet usage has started going right up. So I'm now running 56 megabits. And I think in here, if I have a look, I can see the Windows update assistant has started and is installing. So basically I'll just push this out through our RMM. It um, will just run in the background. When it's finished, it pops up with a little window and uh, says to reboot your computer to start making the changes to the new version. So this I believe will update to version 20 H2 or H3 or whatever. Uh, whatever the latest one is I can't actually remember but we will see when it finishes. So once it finishes I'll show you the window that pops up but anyway I'll um, just skip to that now. So once it's finished you will get this window pop up and it will say your update is ready, your PC needs to restart to complete the update. Do you want to restart now? Or you can restart later. So if you want to restart later, you click restart later, otherwise restart now. So if you're running it from a script and doing it silently like I do, this will pop up for the user so they will need to know this is happening. It won't just happen magically in the background and they won't be any none the wiser this will show them this in the foreground of the computer. Um, so they'll need to know to click restart when it pops up to say restart or you just do it last thing at night time, leave their computer on, set it to never sleep and then restart the computer. So you can see here now it's restarting and it will run through the Windows updating stuff like you would when you do a version upgrade. So this can take a while once it's finished, I will cut back in again. So now that update's finished applying, just says you we've just says we're doing some updates to your PC, just like when you log in to a new computer the first time, it runs through this. So, you know, if you're doing this, you probably know what happens when you upgrade Windows. But this is basically what happens when you log in for the first time after the reboot of the installation. So here we go, it says thank you for upgrading to the latest version of Windows. So what we can do to see is right click on start menu and go to settings. And if we go system and about, there we go latest version of Windows 20H2 and it was installed today which you can see that's today's time and date anyway guys if you like that don't forget like and subscribe to see more um, this scripts pretty simple it's linked down below feel free to take it and edit it and do whatever you want with it anyway guys I'll see you next time